In this video, I am going to demonstrate how to create watercolor artwork in Canva. I am also going to share how to turn a photo into watercolor art so it can blend smoothly into the artwork scene. Let's start with a demo. I will go to my Canva account. Click the Create a Design button. You can choose the best size that fits your design. I will choose the Instagram post option. By default, I have one page where I can create my design. For my example, the concept is enjoying the summer heat on a beach. I will go to elements on the sidebar to look for objects that I can add to the page. To look for watercolor objects, always begin your search with the term watercolor then followed by the keyword. Let's say I will search for an island. Click the object to appear on the page. Resize so it will fit the entire page, then we can crop the excess portions of the image. Let's add details to the scene. I will add flamingo. Adjust its size so it will be proportional to other objects on the page. I like to include this coconut drink. I will insert this tree. Search for keyword watercolor beach. Choose this pineapple drink. We can also put the seashell. Let's have a beach umbrella. And chair. Add another seashell. Select starfish. Let's enter the keyword watercolor fish. We have a variety of fish that we can choose from here. I will add more of them. Resize and move them to the water. Before we continue, I will rename the file to watercolor artwork. At this point, I would like to add my photo to this artwork. But first, I will make it a watercolor too, so it will be combined evenly on my artwork. To do that, go to photolab.me slash tag slash watercolor. There are several options that we can choose from here. You can press the load more button to show more options. This is my favorite combo option contributed by Free the Plater. I will click the Apply to your photo button. Upload my image. Adjust its size by using the slider or by using the size options. Click Continue to process. Here's the result. I will click the download button. Let's go back to Canva. I can either use the upload media button to upload my watercolor photo or drag it to the side panel. Click the image to be added to the page. Click edit image and choose the background remover tool. Once done removing its background, press the Apply button. I will flip it horizontally. Adjust its size and crop appropriately. I will search for sun from the elements.
are these clouds. This looks okay to me. To download, press the download icon. The suggested file type is MP4 since I added moving graphics earlier. But for now, I would like to download a PNG file. Press the download button. As we can see, it has been downloaded to my computer. Let's open it. Here is the result. If you find this helpful, please consider liking the video and subscribing to my channel. Please feel free to leave your comments, questions, and suggestions. Thank you!